going on YouTube? How's everybody doing today? Um, please excuse the, the voice, a uh, little under the weather. But I got a fun package in from Bold Precious Metals. Um, of course, getting silver in, getting packages in always makes uh, one feel a little bit better. <laughs> so, uh, just a fun mix today and I'm going to share it with, with everybody. I already opened it up because I want to, my plan is to give everybody a really good look at these, at these coins and these pieces. So, uh, first one I'll start with is something obviously many of you seen. Um, already um, one of the one of the few sets that I'm still currently working on uh, is the Queen's Bee so I went ahead and picked this one up and it's a it's a it's an alright design um, other than the the feet on the bird it looks pretty good I wish there was a little bit more maybe chest feathers in there but the, the feet look kind of weird but other than that um, it's a it's a decent quality coin so move that one up out of the way and uh, I'll just get right into it. You guys know that I like to collect uh, coins from Scottsdale. And I try to pick up all the stuff that they come out with. So I went ahead and uh, picked up quite a few different things today that I'm going to share with you. And then uh, I'll try to give you a really good look at. I opened them all up here. Open the capsules up to give you real good looks. Um, check out the different finishes on this one. This is a newer one. They have Pacific Dollar 2018. Um, pretty nice looking Pretty nice looking coin. We'll flip it over and check out the reverse. I like uh, the different finishes that they use um, and the different uh, textures that they put in the fields. Pretty nice looking. Pretty nice looking. I like that one. Get that one out of the way here. We'll move on to the next here. This one here is. Montserrat, I hope I said that right, but uh, Emerald Isle of the Caribbean. This is part of their Caribbean series where they're going to have uh, eight in total. Um, and they have quite a, I'm trying to think, they have uh, five out right now, I believe, of the eight. Uh, so they're moving right along with that series and they all, they all have the same, they all have the same reverse. Not a bad looking. Not a bad looking reverse on those coins. Next one I'll share with you here. I like this one. This one looked kind of, um, kind of plain actually with just the stock photos. But I saw the the picture. If you check out the colorized one, there's a lot of detail in there. And uh, as you can see, the divers there, and what they did is uh, you, you see uh, the texture there in the field, it's its meant to be sun rays coming down, shining through the water onto the divers, which is kind of a neat effect. Um, pretty good looking coin there. Pretty good looking coin. And the back of this one's the same as the last one uh, that I just showed you, so I'm not going to bore you with that. Uh, where are we at next here? Okay, this next one here um, is a Barbados dollar. This is the 20... 18 they did change this one up obviously it still has the trident there in the center however the fields are completely different if you remember uh, last year there was more of a, a line um, like a texture of water um, like ripples is, is the word I was searching for and this here just kind of it's just a little bit more of a just more of a smooth textured back so they changed the design up on this one and this one does have a does have a fun reverse on it, uh, which I do enjoy. Uh, here we go, flip the right way. Pretty nice looking coin, these Barbados coins. Very, very cool. Let's move on to the next one. And this is another one that was uh, similar. Uh, I just, this is the 2018, obviously this came out in 2017. I still think it's a beautiful design. I really like the different uh, textures they put in the fields. And the ripple effect that they have. It's a, it's a beautiful coin. Beautiful coin in hand for sure. Flip this over. And on the on the back, you can see the queen there. And they continue on with the textures. Uh, just a real sharp, sharp design, sharp strike on that one. It's nice. Next one we will look at is the African Leopard. This is the second coin in this series. And uh, it's a pretty sharp looking coin. The premium's a little bit higher on this one um, compared to the others. 
But, you know, I, I like to collect these, so I'm going to pick it up anyway. I just pick up one. Uh, as you can see, the trees in the back there. You know, he's uh, getting a meal. <laughs> he's eating. He's uh, ripping some flesh. Um, but it is a beautiful, beautiful coin. Let's go ahead and check out the reverse of this one. Same design as last year's. I don't have the other one in hand, but I'm pretty positive this is exactly what it looked like. Five CDs, Republic of Ghana. Pretty sharp looking coin there as well. We got some more here. I'll try to get through this so it's not too long. Um, I needed to pick up the next one. This is another series that I'm working on. It's the Marvel series. Um, Deadpool here looks pretty cool. Yeah. Pretty nice design. You know, I'll let you guys, you know, when you get these coins, if you, you know, they look all right in the capsule, but a lot of these coins, you get them out and you get a good look at them. You can see so much more detail, you know. Obviously, I open them up carefully and I try not to, you know, get my fingers all over them. But, uh, you know, you can open them up. You can really enjoy the, the design of these of these coins. So, and we got uh, one more to short, share with you. Let me get it over here. This is a new offering. Let's zoom out for a second. New offering from Scottsdale Mint. You may have heard of it. It's the Terracotta Army, the five ounce antique coin. There's a mintage of 10,000 of these. Just thought it was pretty cool. I'll let you uh, pause and read that if you, if you, if you want to. If you know that um, the story behind this where they found all these um, soldiers, unique soldiers all buried into the ground. But this one's a little bit different uh, than the Egyptian relic. As in, it's a little bit more shiny. It's got more of a hammered finish, I would say, on the ends instead of a rough finish. Um, feels really nice and chunky in the hand. It's a pretty cool piece. Definitely, uh, definitely nice in the hand. Happy that I picked this one up. It's, uh, it's pretty cool and happy to add it to the Scottsdale collection. So, and obviously here it comes with a bag and stuff. So, Well, that's what I picked up this time. Um, this was, a, again, um, an order from Bold Precious Metals. I've been, been picking up a lot of um, packages from them lately just because, you know, they, they got a pretty good selection. They don't have a huge selection, but they got a nice Scottsdale selection. And, uh, and that's what I'm looking for. And they beat everybody's prices <clears throat> from what I've seen so far. Um, you know, if Atmex comes out with the same thing or they come out with it, they'll make sure that they beat them. <clears throat> Excuse me. But... There's the stack. What do we got here? We got uh, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, we got about 14, 14 ounces there. Yep, 14 ounces to add to the stack. Hope everybody enjoyed the video. I appreciate every, each and every one of you for stopping by. Please like, comment, subscribe. Um, I'll have another one here soon for you. And uh, once again, appreciate you.